Here I'm going to show using the National Instruments Motion add-on for NI Veristan in NI Veristan 2009. My currently active project contains a blank system definition file. If I open up System Explorer, you'll see that with this add-on installed, I can right-click Custom Devices and select the 73XX Motion Controller. This adds the motion controller to my system configuration. Here on the main page, I can select the board ID of my NI Motion hardware, and then select the axis I wish to manipulate. Finally, I can select the operational mode of this motion controller add-on. In the absolute position mode, I can select using the target position channel what position I want the add-on to move this axis to. And using the velocity channel, I could specify a maximum velocity to move it. I could also change the relative position mode. In the relative position mode, you do the same thing, except on the target position channel, you specify a relative position for it to move to. Finally, in the velocity mode, you can use the velocity channel to set a target velocity. Feedback is provided by the current position and current velocity channels. Finally, the reset position channel can be used to reset the current position of the motion device. Using the motion controller add-on for National Instruments in iVerisand 2009, you could easily add motion control to your HIL or real-time test application.